Hey hey, it's Similoni here again and in this video I'm going to show you the most important indicator you need whilst trading. This indicator is the VWAP and the VWAP stands for Volume Weighted Average Price. And basically it's just an indicator that takes into account not just the price but also the volume. So at the bottom of the screen here, this is um, my indicator that shows volume average and basically when it's red it just shows there's greater selling pressure there are more people selling more traders selling than those buying and when it shows the green the buyers step in and we see the, the green um, bars at the bottom here so um, the VWAP this purple line <coughs> dotted line has actually taken into account the volume at the bottom as well as price price action. So if we look at um, my first white box, in this first white box, we'll see that price action in the first green candle is below, closes below the VWAP. But the very next candle, price action closes above VWAP. This would be a perfect point at which to enter into a trade. Now, after entering into a trade, when we look at the action thereafter, we can see the movement of price was upwards. So we have, this is a one, no, this is a five minute chart actually. Okay, so we have five, 10, 15, 20 minutes of upward movement. So at the point at which, um, this area that I call the area of consolidation, what you see now is, you know, you see a little bit of price, um, you know, kind of like a seesaw movement going on. It's not going beyond the top level here. It's not going beyond $364.72. So it's not breaking below $363.03. So we have a little bit of consolidation going on here. It's it's not up, it's not down, it's here, it's there. And so usually what you're looking for at this point, I mean, at this point, it would be safe to exit a trade. I would exit the trade. Um, when I was newer to trading, I would hold on to the trade. And, you know, at this point, it can go either way. It can break out above price action and it can break out below price action. So it just depends on how risk averse you are as to you know whether you want to hold onto your trade or not. I personally would have exited at this red candle. Or if not this red candle, at this red red candle. Once I see, you know, price action is kinda, you know, it's humming and hoeing and it's not doing it's not neither going up, it's neither coming down, then it's time to get out with my profit. And as we see here, price action broke below. The, the level drawn here so it broke below and then not only that it broke below VWAP so at this point would be a perfect time to get out of the trade if you hadn't already gotten out of the trade at this area of consolidation our second white box again shows uh, a point at which you could re-enter this trade or enter it for the first time again we have previous candles, previous two candles are red candles and um, they are have both closed under VWAP. This green candle opens under VWAP but by the time it closes at the end of the five minutes it has closed above VWAP. Again, perfect point at which to go back into a trade and after going back again you can see, not only can you see the increased um, um, you can see the increased volume in trading by the buyers. You also see the movement going up. Again, we get into some kind of little consolidation going on here. So, but the point of the matter is the VWAP is a very important indicator to have on your charts if you're in this business to make money. In and of itself, the VWAP may not As is the case with most of the indicators, I wouldn't rely on any one indicator, but I would use the VWAP to confirm my, uh, my, 
I would use the VWAP to com confirm or to back up any other notion that I have to get into a trade or out of a trade. So it would be just one of the other things that I would be looking at. For instance, the first and main thing I would look at would be the price action. Second thing would be looking at the trend of the market. Is the tr market trending up? Is it trending down? And you know, there's just so many other indicators out there. But for purposes of this one video, we're just focusing on the VWAP as a critical indicator to have on your chart. I hope this has been beneficial to you. Please, please like the video. Don't forget to subscribe, comment below, and I'll meet you on the next video.